if I direct your attention to the ceiling on the left, those pipes are keeping you warm. I will take four minutes here to explain how we saved about $150,000. In 2000 and 2001, before I became pastor, Kibitzai Lutheran Church entered the process of switching over from a boiler system that took between 15 and 20,000 gallons of fuel oil to heat this building each year. And our boiler room was back there. Um, some of you have seen the, the room just off the kitchen that now is the, the heart of our geothermal system. The basics on what geothermal does is in the field on this side of the church, there are a large number of wells that have been drilled that are circulating water. And it is using energy that has been stored within the, within the earth. That water then goes into this room that you've seen into four heat pumps, which by the way are produced eight miles up the road in Appleton, Minnesota. Those heat pumps then pump the water through these pipes, and you'll see these units here on the left and on the right. The heat is blown into the room from that. I'll just give you the cost on the system. It was a great debate in this congregation of 500 people in a town of 300. It cost about $170,000. There was much debate on whether to spend that money. At the time, we were spending money in the range of $15,000 to $20,000 a year for fuel oil. Has anyone ever been to a wedding in August in Minnesota where you don't have air conditioning? <laughs> That was this congregation in about six years ago. We didn't have air conditioning. The $20,000 that was budgeted was buying fuel oil at 99 cents a gallon just to heat our building in the winter. So you can do the math, 99 cents, 15 to $20,000. I believe the fuel oil, oil peaked last year at nearly $4. Um, we have an annual budget of about $200,000. If we had not switched over to the system that we're using now, uh, we could have paid between fifty dollars and $80,000 to heat this building. Last year, all of our energy needs cost $6,500. So you can do the math in your head. Our, our debate on whether it was worth it to put that heating system in has paid for itself. Um, almost two times over in those years. And one of the great benefits that came along, this heating system also provides air conditioning. <laughs> so our energy needs, including heat, air conditioning, all the electricity needed to, to run our systems within the church was about $6,500. Uh, very good use of stewardship of, of the land, of the energy we're using, and it saved us a bundle of money. So that's a little bit of information on that. You're welcome to take a look at the, at the heat pumps that are in that room.